Well, for this game, we have travelled through the Clyde Tunnel to the south side of Glasgow. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player, Stuart Robson. And what we have to look forward to is live coverage of this Scottish Premiership match. Stuart, what are your expectations for today? Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. And here's the lineup for Rangers. Todd Cantwell plays alongside John Lundstrom in central midfield, and it's two strikers up front who will look to provide the goal scoring threat. And this is the initial 11 for the visitors today. Well, they're starting with an attacking 4-5-1 formation with three players in advance of two holding midfielders. But it's important that the wide players come in field to join the centre forward at the right time. And the match begins. Lundstrom. Davis. And you can sense the threat is there. He'll be delighted to have won the ball having made that difficult challenge. Alfredo Morelos. And a really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. Mackay. Cochran. Well, he knew he had to get to the ball, and he did. Lundstrom. James Tavernier Ryan Kent has it Raska looking for that final pass looking for the goal that would put them ahead Josh Ginelli here's Barry Mackay can they forge ahead they do and you've got to say, the good value for the lead. Well, here's the replay. He does well to find that bit of space in the box, and then he shows a lot of composure to finish it off. That's a good goal. Are back underway and 1 0 it is. Let's see what happens next. Cantwell. Now with Raskin. Alfredo Morelos. Well, racing past his man. As you can see, the weight of the through ball is key to this goal, and the finish is clinical. He just makes it look so easy, doesn't he? Goal! 
So a level contest, 1-1. Ginelli not getting anxious when they have the ball but then the commentator's curse comes into play well that's really strong play to keep hold of the ball well, as you can see, Rangers have really dictated the play, but it's been a frustrating performance from them so far. They just haven't had enough guile in the final third. It's all been a bit too predictable, which has to change if they want to win this one. Well, looking to put the ball to good use here. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. And so it is, the first half story has been written. This man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Stuart. Well, they weren't at their best, but with that equaliser, you can see why he's so important to this team. Hopefully they can get more of the ball to him in the second half so he can show us his ability. And as the second half commences, both sides can reflect on a first half in which they were so very evenly matched. Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. Well, the threat was very real, marvellous defending. Nikola Raska. Barisic. And they continue to advance. And a lot of options here. But nothing comes of it. An alert piece of defending. Thirty minutes left for play. Josh Ginelli. Oh, a perfectly timed pass. And a goal! In the lead again! Fully deserved! Well, here's the replay, and he shows great awareness to play this through ball. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. So on with the match. 2-1 is the scoreline. What's going to happen next? Barisic. Lundstrom. Good movement. Cadwell. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. Well, there you can see it. The visitors haven't been able to control possession, but they've certainly shown an ability to counter-attack when they win it back. I expect more of the same. I think it's been a really good performance from them so far. It's really good without the ball, and the all-around performance levels have been high. Could be! Oh, wonderful save! Well, he reacts so quickly there. That's a great save. Both managers deciding this is the time to change things around. Both teams going to the bench. It's a short one. Can he finish this? Oh, could be. Oh, that's top-notch goalkeeping, you've got to say. And they'll get ready for the throw-in. 
They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. He has time to play it over. A possession lost, intercepted. Well, he had to read it and get there, and did. There might very well be late excitement. Five minutes left, and the margin just one. Well, I have to say, these fans have been excellent. They still believe they're going to get back into this. So two minutes of stoppage time here. And there goes the final whistle. It's gone the wrong way as far as the home fans are concerned. Well, Derek, certainly not their best performance, was it? Just a little bit off the pace for me and obviously a disappointing result. But the key thing is they bounce back now and they can't afford a repeat performance. But it just seems in this game, he's been a step ahead of his opponents in every way, Stuart. Well, he gave them a really hard time, didn't he? His speed of thought was excellent, and he took the winning goal so well. He was brilliant today.